Yeah, it looks super ready. sick. <laughs> I'm actually almost jealous. He loved it. I need one like that. Ready, Jordan? Let's get out of here. Let's go see Nani's. Come on, lights, camera. What is it? Is that a little? Is that a little mousy? Sounds actually sounds like a bird. Julius loves it. You like it, Julius? Yeah. All right, Jordan. Let's go, Jay. Come on. Glasses. Couldn't find it. All right. Just remember that I had put them in there. I hate laundry. Can I just say, the one thing that I'm not committed to as I become more and more successful is laundry. Don't want to do laundry anymore. I just don't. Wow, gorgeous. The moon's out right now. Just dropped off, baby J. Monday, last Monday. I like to reflect when it gets to be closer to my birthday. So when it gets closer to my birthday, I like to just kind of rejoice and just reflect on life in general. And so this is the last Monday that I'll ever be 33 again, as I'll be 34 this Saturday on March 14th. I think we're gonna give Red her first tattoo. <laughs> I'm gonna get another tattoo as well, so we're gonna be looking at doing that on Saturday and then doing a family dinner Saturday night. Interesting, I wanted to talk about something really quick because as soon as I got in my 30s, for those of you that are younger, that aren't in your 30s, this is something that maybe you can reflect on later on in life. And someone who's over your 30s, maybe already had this happen, comment below if this is something that sounds familiar. Because as soon as I got in my 30s, I started slowing down and not wanting to have as much fun as far as like going out and dating and hanging out with different girls and partying and all that type of stuff. And I wanted to kind of settle down a little bit more and just kind of look at possibilities of potentially meeting the one. Met you, honey. Um, so, so that happened. From, and now that I'm getting closer to 34, I'm starting to get out of the world of and the, and, the, and the want of needing to buy stuff. I think on last week's episode, we went shopping at the mall, Reds and I, I was looking at some watches, then I was looking at some shoes, and then we're gonna get Jordan some shoes, if I would get one 50% off, had it in clearance items, but I guess the one that I looked at wasn't clearance, it was on sale, so it's all little fine line detail stuff, right? So she couldn't get what she wanted, and I was like, well, I'm gonna buy what I want, so I'm literally at the cash register, needing to think about the purchase before I make it, and I wanted to transfer some cash, and I'll keep everything in my main account, so that way it's not that accessible. So it makes me think about, am I gonna spend this money or not? Well, long story short, walked away, didn't spend the money, and it felt really great not to do that. So now coming into my closer to mid-30s, I'm now like, I don't really care about shoes and watches and fancy clothes and wanting to spend money on that. Now I'm more interested in investments and saving cash. And of course, uh, you know, the new house that we're gonna be getting, uh, we'll talk more about it very, very soon because it's coming up very, very fast. And the Nissan GTR that I want, and you know, just more wealth and abundance and prosperity and reoccurring revenue coming in because right now it's like, I want to be out of debt, I want to be able to free up cash, and I want to be able to have reoccurring coming in for me personally on top of the company that we already have reoccurring for. Lift off agent. Yes. Real estate agent, you gotcha. Go ahead and sign up today. That was interesting. Off to the house. Happy Monday. I hope you guys are enjoying this week's YouTube episode. That moment where it's like 12 o'clock and you were already supposed to be at Domenico's downtown Danville, Norm. Where are you? Um, yeah. Driving through Crow Canyon? What's up, son? Yeah. They go meet with a referral partner. His name's Kyle. This is the marketing meeting on Tuesdays, and it's always good when you have a small business or just a business in general that you have brand ambassadors, referral partners, people that uh, yeah want to refer you business and want to uh, you know trust that you have their best interests at heart. So that way, when they give you that referral, you make them look good, and then it's a win-win for all parties. So we're gonna go have lunch today because he. Referred us a couple clients. Bought him some suspenders and a bow tie. I don't, I'm not wearing any suspenders or a bow tie today, but I bought him a couple things to say thank you. Now I'm gonna take him out to lunch. It's going down in the club. Going to Sims. 
and this is a pretty awesome place, Sims Inc. in Hayward. So you'll have to stay tuned to the end to find out more about what happens with our tattoos. Dance, dance, dance. Daddy daughter day, look at this girl. Go girl, go girl. <laughs> she goes around so many times until she falls. You're so cute. Dance, dance. You're so cute. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. She just keeps going around and around and around and around and around and then she falls. And she enjoys it. I'm over here working along <coughs> inside her plane and balancing work and daddy daughter day. The Thursday before, I'll be 34. Come on, easy. To, to play with your cell phone to distract yourself mm. from those feelings well when you understand that change really requires becoming uncomfortable to a certain degree and that's normal that you're yeah. leaving the known and you're stepping into the unknown then it begs the question what thoughts do you want to fire and wire in your brain because your attention on those thoughts begins to re reorganize circuitry we re mold the brain mm. all right it's friday and i've been waiting to open this Reds has not let me touch or look or see. Actually, I've been touching it and looking at it and seeing it, but I can't hold it. What's in it? I want to find what's in that package. Okay, so what is this? shine some light because I feel that like I don't know about you but I feel like for me every year when I like have you know it's time for my birthday get close to my birthday I reflect on like oh my god it's the last couple of days before I'll be this age for the rest of my life and it's such a blessing to be alive and we can't forget the small little things that we have in our lives that makes us who we are today that makes us whole that makes us happy which I hope you're whole and happy and everything's going well for you life and so at the end of the day I just wanted to say that uh, you know it is my birthday coming up on Saturday I am very grateful to be able to share my life with you social fam I'm grateful for your viewership I'm grateful for you subscribing I'm grateful for you liking hitting the notification bell watching these episodes every single week and I just want to say that uh, you know you're amazing you're absolutely amazing. I'm on the way to pick up Baby J. We're getting closer and closer. We've got some really cool stuff coming up. Reds and I, first time ever getting tattoos together. And it's about to be epic. So see how it goes. So let's go get you. Well, just in time for the birthday. About to sell the mats. Got a buyer. The one, the only. Duncan. Where, oh, where's Weed? So, uh, Weed is taking me out for my birthday. He wanted to go out with Poonam and Reds and everyone. We were gonna all hang out, but uh, Reds is at home making some stuff and getting some stuff ready because we're gonna have the family over on Sunday. It's about to go down, super exciting. 
outside of all the other stuff that's going on right now, it's nice just to be able to like live a normal life and not need to like, you know, think about all the other stuff. So there he is. Where is he though? We got that front row seat over here, getting that sushi. California, and this is their vegetarian mango and avocado. It looks delicious. And this old fashioned, how do you recommend this old fashioned? Man, they're just straight taking care of me over here. That's the last thing I want. So I'm back, and what is going on with all of this? This is. Honey, you are just too amazing. Way too amazing. It is decked out. And we got uh, cupcakes over here. Look at these cupcakes. Cupcakes over here. And then she's over here, just Betty Crocker. Making this special dessert. Love it. Look at these layers. Look at those layers. Look at those layers. How am I supposed to do this right now? Supposed to open this right now, Melissa says. She says, open this. What do you got there, honey? Uh, I got a bag with a uh, ribbon. A gift for you. And uh, it looks kind of pink bag to me. Oh, well, it matches your outfit then. What is this? I don't know. This is a DJI Osmo Pocket. What? Open it. Android iPhone new, what is that? I had a feeling. Of course you did, you already knew. Or we're, you know. No surprise. We're one and the same, honey. OMG, baby! Check it out. Osmo Pocket. So we've had one of these about a year ago. This time last year. And I screwed up, left it next to a machine, and it was stolen. So now I have it again, and I have 128 megabytes. Thank you, honey. I really, really, I really appreciate this. And you have special I, insurance. I miss this. This was so much fun. So what do you mean by special insurance? If something happens to it, they replace it. Even if I like lose it? Mm-mm. I don't think losing it is one, but if it's damaged. Uh, we need more from this. But thank you, honey. I really appreciate it. Get it, girl. Get it, Jay. Day in the life, social fam, happy Saturday. So as you saw last night, Wifey got me the Osmo Pocket. This is the Osmo Action, and let's go ahead and switch over to the Osmo Pocket in three, two, one. Boom, all right, now we are on the Osmo Pocket. You can see like, it's pretty smooth, pretty clear. Huh, huh, huh? Okay, let's go. Baby Jay, you ready? You ready, Jay? We'll go drop you off. You like a new camera? All right, we'll play, we'll play with it later, okay? Let's get out of here. Beautiful, such a beautiful day. And almost there. Cool. Today is free ice cream day. Jordan, Thank you. what are you doing over there? Happy birthday. Happy birthday. I know, he's practically doing it. So we are now off to the first time ever. I don't know who you bank with, but we're going to the Capital oh. One downtown Walnut Creek. They have a bistro, as you saw in the footage. It's so amazing. So we're going to get some cash, and then we're off to our next stop. I think it's over here. I'm not sure. So we're right here, we're here off of North Main. And um, what are you doing over there, honey? I am editing some photos that I had of you. Oh, my normie. Jeez. My birthday boy. Presidential looking or something. So, beautiful day. 
beautiful day in the neighborhood. Let's go find this uh, Capital One. I think it's coming over, coming up here over on the right. Yeah, I think it is. Let's see. up social fam it's like what in the world i feel like i'm not like a house it's pretty freaking dope this place is amazing you enjoying yourself are you enjoying yourself it's pretty sick huh Red's first, Red's first tattoo in I think a very, very awesome place. On Google, right? And so I'm thinking, you say you wanted some kind of dimension, it has a little dimension to yeah. it. And then pulling these flames out a little further that way, and maybe the ice okay. a little bit this way. I wasn't sure if you were into the ice or maybe you're stuck that's pretty on the cool. Waves. I think it's pretty cool. It's different too. Yeah, that's the whole thing. Just want something different. And yeah, stuff that's just gonna like stand out and something unique. And I'm all about like the the positive and negative. Yeah, you know what I'm saying I do a lot of motivational type stuff with videos. And oh, whatnot. okay. So like that's why I kind of want something to kind of symbolize and mean something a little more deeper too. Yeah. And it's our first time doing it together. She's never done one before. So it's her oh, okay. first tattoo. And then, um, the only thing I wasn't sure because I was gonna just do like build off of the actual yin yang. I didn't yeah. know if you wanted the black and white in there. Okay. And then, but this was this this doesn't really have any of the yin, but you can see it in there. Yeah, yeah. So I was gonna build off of this, and maybe you have the some waves coming into this, and then some fire coming out of it. But I don't know. I, I seen this, and it's kind of caught my eye right off 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 the bat. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. I like that. I like that. Uh, I think it looks pretty cool. Is there anything like because uh, it's not really. Hmm. I'm just trying to think because I like how this side you can really see how it's a yin yang. Yeah. And then you can tell that it's there because you have the two dots. You can tell it tell and you can see yeah. like, the S in the center. Um, the only thing I can do, I, I mean, I can, I can like bowl these outlines out a little bit right here. Okay, okay. And you, you know? can kind of see, you can kind of see the line going this way a little bit too. Yeah. You know, I can kind of just hit well. those a little harder. Yeah, like, yeah. You know, like, you know, and it'll just make it pop out more. Yeah, maybe if we could just hit that a little harder so it pops out, but then yeah. it almost fades in the background. Yeah. So I like that. And then um, and then a little bit more accentuation on the flame. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And a little bit more accentuation on the ice. Okay. It's kind of what I was thinking, just so that way it really just like shows and you get that good like, okay, I can tell this is like a flame and I can tell this is really ice and it looks pretty good like that too. Just um, yeah. Probably just make it pop a little bit more because I was like looking online. I was doing a bunch of research and I was like, well, yeah, they get a little, they get a little kind of um, a little um, busy. Some yeah. of them are a little busy and stuff. Like, take me in the sea. You lift my heart in pain. Yeah, you don't have to have made it now. You want me to stay. Tattoos are all completed, and now we're over at the Veggie Grill and about to get some amazing food. Good morning. Happy birthday to you. Thank you. Cha, cha, cha. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Got you guys on YouTube. I knew you. I knew I had to give a Happy birthday, birthday to you. Why is it so loud? Okay, Happy it. birthday.
What's up, social fam? So I hope you enjoyed this week's YouTube episode, and thank you to everyone that uh, sent birthday wishes. I really, really appreciate it. This week's episode is very difficult because I have the Osmo Pocket, I have the Osmo Action, I have the Note 9 um, photos and this and that, and I have so much more footage that I'm going to show you more next week. And my computer kind of died on me this week, and if you watched uh, the episode about the MacBook Pro buying new versus is refurbished well i bought one yesterday on sunday fun day i'm filming this on monday and so uh that comes this week and i'll be editing next week's episode of the new macbook pro with the new osmo pocket i'm so excited thank you for your continued support i really 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 appreciate it the beginning of this episode there was no intro i didn't come in and say anything that like, i'm mental k3 or anything at all um so let me know what you guys think please 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 thumbs up subscribe hit the notification bell we're giving away 200 at the end of each month for each and every lucky subscriber just gotta be a subscriber like follow connect subscribe down below Say 2020 is your year. We'll enter you in to win. Appreciate your continued support. We'll see you next week.